Today is Friday, April 9th, 2010, and we're here at the Covington Celery's Winery in Woodinville, Washington, one of my new clients. Today's Friday photo assignment is shooting in indoor spaces. What is different about shooting indoors is truly dealing with lighting. Now I've mentioned in prior photo assignments, but I really want you to understand Kelvin temperature. Look up Kelvin temperature online or on Wikipedia or anywhere on Google. Kelvin is K-E-L-V-I-N. You need to understand the difference between indoor lighting when it deals with candlelight, when it deals with tungsten lighting, which is T-U-N-G, S-T-E-N, look that up, and how that's different from daylight. When you photograph indoors, you need to understand how to play with temperature so that your correct uh, exposures show the proper lighting. So take a look, this is a fun space. It's a neat winery, there's great barrels. They really wanted photographs for their marketing material that showed a lot of ambiance. They wanna hold events here, weddings, parties, get-togethers, and they really want people to know that it is a cozy space and so by using this special lighting in here with just the candles and some of the ambient light coming in it really helps provide that mood that's really important in your photographs to be able to convey that so take a look at those kelvin temperature tungsten lighting daylight find out what those are and look through your camera manuals so you can figure out how to adjust your camera accordingly with every picture that you take you may notice when you go indoors, you might have a really deep amber cast or a really bright blue cast to your photos. Temperature is the key point as to why. Have a great week. Send me your images if you'd like a critique on them to bluesfire at mac.com. We'll see you soon.